Hi, I'm Matt Routing. And I'm Katie Archer, and we're reporting from the Clackamas Print. In this week's issue of the Clackamas Print, we had two major news stories. One is the new developments in the campus safety, and the other one is talking about the school's policy on staff and student relationships. We would like the students to weigh in and voice their opinions respectfully about these topics. Please check out the stories on the clackmasprint.com. In last week's issue of the Clackmas Print, we had two reviews. The first was a review of the Animal Collective concert that happened on the 5th of March. And um, you can check that out on the back page of the issue, which is currently on stands as well. The other review was of the new Esperanza Spalding album, Emily's D Plus Evolution, which has received universal acclaim, including from the Clackmas Print. You can read about that on page 11. Um, also, in the issue, there was an advance on Spalding's lecture at Reed College that took place uh, last night, which was the 10th. And um, in that lecture, she played some awesome bass and sang some really good songs. She talked about the nature of creativity. talked about life philosophies and as well as sharing some of her own life story with some of the young musicians who had a lot of questions to ask her. First, this came from her this week. It's not very exciting, but the results are very exciting. You just, um, you, you start by practicing and going to get the note. Like with your, with your intention, not your body. And Rufus' whole thing is about staying in the fingerboard, like staying in the instrument. So what I asked my body to do was like, this is just a warm-up, but it's important. Sometimes I'm not done with anything else, I'll just do this. So what I asked my left hand to do is just to stay with the finger, stay with this instrument. So I asked to stay in the fingerboard. It was a fantastic event, and Esperanza Spalding was quite inspiring. I'm Matt Rowning. And I'm Katie Archer, signing off for the Clackmas Print. Be sure to check out our next issue on April 13th.